Hey folks, Lyari here. Today we're going to be reacting to Six People Who Have Been Cheated On Verse One Secret Cheater Odd One Out by Jubilee. I'm excited for this video. I haven't reacted to Jubilee since like my first really react video, I think. And they're great content. And I'm going to try and play along and see how I do. We'll see. He was saying some really mean and just not true things about me on social media so I printed out screenshots of it and I brought his I love her fit that's oh my god okay I love the pink shirt and that the uh, pink top and the jeans and also oh my god this so good such a fan anyway sorry <laughs> and I taped all of those screenshots to the package so that his mom could wow. read them wow. We brought together seven people who've been cheated on. My name's Sejan and I've been cheated on. My name is Ankhul and I've been cheated on. Hi, my name is Morgan and I have been cheated on. Hi, I'm Marianne and I've been mm. cheated on. Hi, my name is Vivian and I kind of don't trust her, I'm not going to lie. Hi, the way she said it. I've been cheated on. Hi, my name is Vivian and I've been cheated on. Hi, my name is she's just a bit I've been cheated on. Hi, my name is Sure, she's just a bit intimidating. <laughs> One of them is a cheater. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll split a cash prize. If the liar survives, they win the entire prize. Who is the odd one out? Hi, everyone. Hi. Hi. How's everyone going? doing? Okay. Round one. Great. So, Great. who's cheated? <laughs> Could be him. That's a pretty basic, you know. Psychology class, and what they said is when you talk to people, look into their eyes and ask them a question. So I, I, I can ask the question to everybody. Or some, somebody wants to ask. They <laughs> can see uh, their pupils, yeah. like, like they like dilate crazy. a little or something like that. Like, he took on a leadership role immediately. Maybe he was asking those questions so that he could give his prepared response to kind of try to convince us. I'm yeah. just gonna go straight for the kill question. Like, mm. do you guys think cheating is like a rude? Like, could you be redeemed after that? Oh man, I, 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 personally I, think, I, I think it's very nuanced. I think that most of the time, no. But also, she might give it out quick. Also, like for me, I was cheated on twice, but one of the times I was 15, and it's like, do I think that that person is gonna be a cheater their entire life? I don't mm. think so. We were yeah. kids. That's that's fair. That's that's very fair. I was gonna say there is also kind of a gradient, like. I mean, for me, I'm not a very jealous person. If you're drunk at a bar and you kiss a stranger and you feel bad about it, like I can swallow that. Mm. But if you're fully like, I, I guess it depends on how drunk. You have to be pretty drunk. Went home with someone like at each level did not stop a hookup from happening, which is what happened to me. She said something about like if you if you just kiss somebody at like a bar That's or something fair. like that, uh, you know, it's not that bad or something. Like so that right there was still considered like a form of cheating to me. So I thought she was the mole herself. Oh. The person and how much they're willing to make it work and change mm -hmm. you know because i i do believe in change but if they're like making excuses they're just like oh i'm sorry babe but it'll never happen again yeah. and then, then they yeah. they like change for like that period of time and then it happens again you know it's kind of like what is your commitment to your change i think it's her but she's also been cheated on i'm not gonna lie i don't know maybe i'm wrong I think, like, she, she may have had, like, I don't think she cheats now, but, like, I think she may have had it in the past. I don't know. I'm not going to lock it in yet, but it's only around one. People care a lot about cheating and others that don't. Some people will find that more redeemable. I feel like most people would care about cheating and others. Yeah. Huh. I just felt like he was very confident, but in a way that felt scripted i don't think so i don't yeah, think it was said that stuff or... about not everyone cares about cheating and i was like that's that's a little off to me i don't know i don't think it was him either we actually have a tie the tie at least based off this so far Ali and tijan tijan do you want to go ahead and, and go first i really didn't get that much time to talk so i was just kind of like letting you guys talk it all out i got cheated on when I was in college and I actually found it very interesting what you said. Yeah, you. Okay. Because you were saying that like you could forgive somebody who was um, like just hooking up if they were just like a random stranger kissing and that's actually what my ex did to me. So Oh. Oof. <laughs> Yikes. Well, I, I actually 
grew up in like a traditional Indian family household, so the way I was brought up was to always treat women with respect. For me, actually, I have a very interesting story how I found out that my uh, girlfriend was cheating on me. I, the, the way he's like uh, constructing his argument is interesting to me. I feel like he's probably gonna get put it off so far. Facebook profile picture with her with another dude. He's like, oh, we've been best friends for two years. Come to find out we've been dating for two years. What? That's my story. Okay. I guess I was wrong. Yeah, I knew that coming in, I was going to be eliminated first. I'm just seen as somebody who's a player. It just all just kind of like made sense to me. Did you do anything I crazy when they cheated on you? I was about to. <laughs> I can see that. He does like, he literally, like he has like the necklace. I can see how he's coded that way and like why he would feel like that was like the call out and like it was him and the muslim dude who got picked as the odd one out first round and i don't think they were really that sus <laughs> i was about to when i got cheated on i actually kept it to myself for a week because oh i know it was hard hmm. i don't know why i tortured myself but it was because i was so pissed that i wanted to clamp revenge yeah. And I just ended up flipping in one of our arguments. Yeah. I, we actually, I, I personally actually dealt with not revenge, but I, so I hit up that guy because I found him on social media, you know, and found out that he's been dating me for a long time. So I told him to set up a date with her at Cheesecake Factory, and I was like, I'm just going to show up. Dude, that was my idea. So That's I literally what I want. showed up. My dream. So they're, 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 they're having their date. I, I'm like, this whole plan. I walk in there, and then literally she just goes immediately. She's like bawling out, crying and stuff like that. She's like, I'm so sorry i'm this if that really did happen i'm so sorry but like that was just like crazy to me it was like this perfect cinematic masterpiece of like i wish i could do that he does seem super cop like, like yeah you know what i mean for me uh i, I kind of see at this point why like they might vote him out this round it's kind of kind of sus how like prepared he seems i was actually trying to do a long distance relationship a week in to him being away he cheated on me oh, um no. and he was saying some really mean and just not true things about me on social media so i printed out like screenshots of it and i brought his hoodie she's about to say receipts that's how she said it to her friends i i respect that dropped him off in his parents house and i taped all of those screenshots to the package so that his mom could read them wow, wow. wow. good for her um, i think i was just so caught up in the anger you know mm -hmm. what i mean exactly. and, and the frustration it's just like I couldn't really see clearly. In those moments, I wanted him to feel what I felt. I no longer think it's her. I think it's this dude. He said nothing. They're dude all the way on the right above me. It's hard. There's something yeah, hard to deal really with. Hard. Mm -hmm. really tough. So I just wanted to know what your guys' definition of cheating is. That was like on my mind. Yeah. You know, how would you guys huh. define cheating? I think, I don't know, it's a definition that is really up to like the individual. I think it can change a lot and a lot of people probably agree with that. Like it's really up to someone's boundaries. But obviously, you know, like the typical things like hooking up with someone else, really flirting with someone else, continuing like situation type relationship with somebody would be cheating in my eyes. Hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. there's emotional cheating, physical cheating. That's what I was going to yeah. piggyback off of. Yeah. Can I clarify what I said? Like, I think, like I'm like a really open person, so I like, I'm open about myself to others, but like, in terms of emotional cheating, like, especially if you're not like open to your partner, but like you're like being really close and open to someone else, and like also like nice to them in ways that you aren't to your partner, like, yeah, it's very real. And there's yeah. Last round, this is I would hate to discount anyone who that was their experience of like my offhand comment of like kissing a stranger in a bar. I don't know. I, I'm sorry if that is what happened to you. She that seems sweet. That. I'm not a very jealous person. There are some acts that are cheating, but that I know that given the right person, the right relationship, I would personally be able to forgive. It's not black and white for me. Um, it's also the. I, oh, she kind of sounds like the secret cheater, but like she's too obvious, right? Like intention i think because if someone mm -hmm. do it with malicious intentions like if they really want to harm you or yeah. they really want to end the relationship but they're still in the relationship mm -hmm. but yeah. i think that's the that's it, it's hard like how do you know if it's malicious like how do you know if the person's like not just like they feel bad because they got caught how do you know that it's hard something you need to have an introspection and see like well this is bad i feel like especially within and i don't want to like be that cheater to my generation now but i just feel like in our day and age for like relationships we don't discuss boundaries firm enough of yeah. what everybody thinks their definition of cheating is 
I mean, I agree, but also, like, it's probably better than it is used to be. Like, oh. yeah. But no, like, I feel like especially when you get cheated on, especially at a younger age, we let emotions control us a little bit more. Yeah. And yeah. I feel like doing something crazy is... That's fair. ...a little bit more rational in people's heads at that age. He played out that ideal story of, like, getting back at your ex. It could also just be, like, the typical things that you see at the movies. Okay, so... Yeah, the vote's paid. This is... I. This all, all these votes make sense to me, honestly. I, I have a slight feeling still that it's actually, no. I think it's this guy. I don't know. He's barely said anything. And again, we have another tie. Maybe it's not. Between Avi? And Aaron. I'm gonna lock it yeah, in before uh, the video's I was over. Pretty surprised that I was uh, in another tie again. I was being a bit too casual about it, so yes. I was not surprised. That yes, I girl. Me. I was living in the same town as my ex, and I had to move, and so we knew that we had a deadline. And then when I moved, we decided to have a three-week buffer period where we would do the long distance, and then we had a deadline for our breakup. Two days before that deadline, they went to a pride event and hooked up with somebody else. If you're gonna cheat, let the other person go first. Don't let them sit through that, because that. Yeah, I mean, just kind of picking back off what I was saying, the way I was brought up. Like, I don't... her situation sounds very, like, real. Like, I don't know. I, I trust her to not be the cheater. Maybe. As a good thing at all. Maybe that's just me. Yourself and the other person too. If you do cheat, think about, like, how much damage that can cause to them. Because, like, I know when I got cheated on, I didn't even get into a relationship for at least, like, six months to a year. You guys are actually going to group up and decide on one person. Oh, it's so them. hard. Like, I, I really, like... That dude does seem sincere at this point. Like, it just seems like that's his personality. I'm back to the Asian girl. No, it's Asian. It's a small yellow pant. Okay. You guys might have supported the wrong person. <sighs> Sorry, Avi. Sorry. I said, said a, a story about actually how things unraveled it did honestly look pretty cinematic so i think that's why people thought that i was the i was the mole and any non-cheaters can slide in my dms <laughs> okay hand. respect the mole is still in the box and you would like to continue the game i couldn't focus on all of the people that were <laughs> playing uh but i felt that the people that were out were not the moles all right hmm. that means that the game ends here if the lights turn green, that means yeah, you so the mole out. Remember, I'm locking in red hair. However, if the lights I don't think I'm going to be right. That means the mole is still in the box and you lose. I knew it. Mm. I knew it. Will the moles please reveal themselves? In three, two, one. <laughs> Oh my god, I actually got it! Wait, what? <laughs> it feels so dumb. Uh, don't, don't. Um, so, I've been on both sides. I... I've been cheated on. And I've been the cheater. When I first applied to, to do this, I had, like, only one intention in mind. Is to um, give purpose to my cheat. I was cheated on in college. He was the first person who ever made me feel like I was enough. So then when he cheated on me, I felt like he took that away from me. And I've been struggling with it ever since. For me, the greatest pain wasn't being it's cheated okay. on, but being the person who inflicted the pain that I already knew so well. You knew better, why didn't you do better? Yeah. This you know, so that I thought like they were gonna build up to that, but then I think it, they must have segmented it because it came out weird in like the things so they had to ask her after. Sorry, all will let just my bad. Well, it was just like it just hit. It felt like she was all of our exes telling us what we needed to hear, and I mean we couldn't have asked for a better mole than Marianne because she really gave us that moment to heal, and she was a great like surrogate for uh, mm. everyone who had been hurt to um, get that kind of closure, I suppose. So Marianne, the floor is yours. Mm -hmm. um, even though I won, I I don't want to take it. 
I actually want to give this prize money to the people who've been cheated on. So if I can invite everyone that was with me, right, to come up stage, we're gonna win the celebratory money and I'm gonna give this to you guys. Hmm, I like her. So this I, money I, is going I felt so bad saying that she was, I really don't want to choose her, but. <laughs> you guys just buy me a drink, you want. <laughs> <laughs> everyone stand in on three, two, one. Money, 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 money. Oh. Gonna pick it up in the end, but you know why not? We're just gonna do the little. <laughs> <laughs> she's, I love her. Oh my god, wait, look. She's, like, <laughs> she's great. <laughs> oh no, wait, okay. That was a, that was a really good jubilee. I really like that because like, a I was right. B, it had like a good message. It like. The, the person who cheated was, like, what was a person, and they weren't just, like, like, sometimes it's nicer to, like, be able to think that, like, the person who cheated on you feels bad on it, about it, than it is to, like, just think that, oh, it just really fucking suck. And, like, that person clearly, like, had grown and, like, learned, and I hope that, like, like, she probably, like, I imagine may have, like, made dues in a way. Anyways. I, um, I only, I had accidentally read, oh, let me like this video. I accidentally read this comment before I started the video, so I kind of slightly cheated in that sense by knowing that, like, whoever might have got voted wasn't going to be it. However, I didn't read the second comment, which is good, <laughs> because, Yeah. Yeah, I do wish, like, she, I think, like, Jubilee kind of could have had better question there. Like, I was expecting her to talk about just, like, in general, the pain that, like, the person cheating on her gave her and how it got twisted into her extracting that on others. I feel like that would help some people, you know? Um... Let's see. The first dude thinking he was voted out for seeming like a player was so funny. I'm happy he's confident, though. He doesn't, like, seem like, like, I mean, he has, like, the, like, I think it, I think he was calling out, like, his racial stereotyping, honestly, and, like, I kind of agree. <laughs> um, everyone. Well, for the definition of cheating, it varies depending on the person. Also, everyone. Voted out Tidian for saying people will have varying degrees of care slash reaction for cheating. Yeah. All right, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye. Hey folks, Lyari here. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to like, follow on t YouTube, follow on Twitch, and I think that's it. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye. I stream Mondays in EST. <laughs>